Hello everyone and welcome to Kannapolis Church of God. Today we celebrate the resurrection of Jesus Christ. We don't know exactly what time of day it said about the break of day that Jesus rose from the tomb. But before that time, he had been on the cross. He had been tried and found guilty and was on the cross. He died. He was put in a borrowed tomb and the tomb was sealed with the seal of Pilate. That seemed like a somber moment and a horrible end to a life that was lived for the good of so many people. The Savior that came to save the world was now dead. But on that first day of the week, the power of God came and rolled the stone away and angels heralded his resurrection and Jesus was risen. That's what we celebrate today. We celebrate that Jesus is risen, that he came back from the dead, that he won the victory over death and hell, and he took the keys from Satan that he might provide us everlasting life. That's something to celebrate today, and I hope you've brought a heart full of worship and praise to do just that as we begin our worship in just a moment. The Sunday after Easter, the 24th of April, we're going to have a special guest with us that day, Allison Hart, pastor's wife and preacher in her own renown from Hickory, North Carolina, and she's going to be speaking in our morning service that day. We hope you'll come out and be a part of that service and be blessed by the ministry of Allison Hart. In the midst of all your Easter celebration, Resurrection Sunday celebration, I hope you'll remember that we had a wonderful prayer service just a few weeks ago on a Tuesday night. We're gonna be having another one on May 3rd. Mark it on your calendars, May 3rd will be our next prayer service for the entire church and I hope everybody will come out. Listen, we had a tremendous time in the Lord. 75 people were here. I believe we can have double that this coming time. And just an amazing testimony of something that happened that night. One of our own, Dorothy, had been walking with a cane, results of a stroke and seizures, and was unable to walk without it. But that night, God touched her in a powerful way, and she has not used that cane since. Miracles are happening. And I am looking forward to what God will do in our service Tuesday night, May 3rd. I hope you'll be there 7 p.m. in the sanctuary. And on May 15th, our International Youth and Discipleship Director, Rob Bailey, and his wife, Crystal, will be with us in service. We are looking forward to their ministry. This is a choice man of God and a personal friend, and I know he's going to minister to our souls that day on May 15th. Hey everyone, super excited. Kids Fest is back this year. We are going in May, from May 20th to May 22nd. It's gonna be an awesome time in Charlotte. If your kid going into first grade to fifth grade is interested, please let me know. I have information packets upstairs. The cost this year is $125. We will be doing some fundraisers. In the bulletin you will see there's a sponsor form. If you would like to donate money to help get some of our kids there, or if you'd like to sponsor a kid you can already think of, please fill that out. We haven't been able to go the past two years, so we are super excited, hoping to take a ton of kids, and just can't wait to see what God's gonna do in their lives. Hey, thanks so much for being here today. If this is your first time at the Kannapolis Church of God, we'd love to get some information so we can send you something in the mail this week and keep in touch with you. We won't bug you to death. We just want to let you know we're glad you were here. So if you would, text WELCOME to the number that is above my head on the screen. We'll leave it up there for a few moments so you can get it in your phone. Text WELCOME to that number or you can go by the Welcome Center after church and all our smiling faces back there will make sure to get your information and give you a nice gift as well while you're here. We appreciate your coming. We welcome you and we hope you'll come again. May God bless you for being at the Kannapolis Church of God. Let's get our hearts ready right now if you haven't already and let's be open to what God wants to do in this resurrection celebration service. God's here and he wants you to welcome him in. <music> 